What's up guys? Welcome back to the channel. For those of you who don't know, my name is Chris Moore and in today's video we're going to talk about ECU flashing. It's going to be so exciting. Anyways guys, I've been getting blown up with emails and Facebook messages and Instagram DMs and just all kind of stuff you guys are inquiring about ECU flashing. A lot of people with 07 GSX-R 1000s, 08 Hayabusa's or emailing in thinking they're going to pick up 25 or 30 horsepower from an ECU flash like the 2020 GSX-R1000 I have. Well, unfortunately that's not the case for every bike. So there's certain bikes that ECU flashing makes a humongous difference. And those bikes are a 2011 and up ZX-10 and a 2017 and up GSX-R1000. Okay, so those bikes actually have restrictions in the ECU from the factory. In other words, they almost have like a governor on them. So what we do on those bikes is go in and take that governor off. We remove those restrictions, make it where the throttle stays wide open. Theoretically on a GSX-R1000, whenever you hold the gas wide open, it stays wide open till 11,600 RPMs and then the computer cuts the throttle back so even though you're still wide open the bike is not wide open anymore zx10s they pull ignition timing and then they start closing off the secondary throttle plate so each bike does it a different way but either way when we get rid of those it makes humongous improvements 25 20 30 horsepower sometimes so anyways that makes a big difference if you have a 2007 gsxr 1000 0506 gsxr 1000 i can still flash your ecu still get you some improvements but you ain't getting 30 horsepower man unfortunately it don't work that way realistically maybe five maybe 10 horsepower out of a normal flash on those bikes but it only costs 100 bucks uh so it's cheap it's definitely worth it i can change your fan temps I can do different things on every, different bikes. So some bikes I can turn the FI light off for certain codes. Uh, I can lower the fan temps, which I already said. I can change the engine idle RPM. There's different things, different bikes, like I said. But anyways, I just wanted to update you and kind of let you know what ECU flashing really does. Also too, people are asking what tune goes in the bike. Well the fuel tune and the ignition tune basically the making the horsepower of the bike on these new ones is all done on my dyno so it's somebody else's bike that i have tuned and got perfect here in house you know of course we save that tune and then when you mail your ecu in i upload that tune to your ecu so if everything is working properly on your bike such as your fuel pump your injectors aren't dirty you know and you have similar modifications then that tune should work just perfect for your bike as well anyways be sure to smash that like button subscribe and as always we appreciate you watching guys have a good day